Hi, I'm Teresa Eastler, and welcome to Teresa's Tips. Today's tip came out of a session that I was doing with a group of business people, and so much of the discussion that was going on had to do with the products and services that they were offering. And as the conversation got a little bit heated at time of what would be the best thing to emphasize and where should the focus be, what I was really struck by was that nobody was having the conversation about who they were being in the whole interactions with their customers and their clients. You see, here's the thing about when we're doing business, is your customers, your clients, actually don't care about your products and services. They really care about you. That's the thing that really separates you from everybody else, is you and what you bring to the table as an individual or as a culture of the company. And yes, you do have to have great products. You do have to have great services. And that's not going to win the day. If it does win the day, if you're in a situation that that's the reason somebody decided to do business with you, it's because you had the lowest price. You see, when your focus is all on your products and services and not who you are as an individual or not who you are as a company, you will be in the dogfight of a commodity competition. There's nothing special about you. You're going to have to keep duking it out for having the better feature or this new thing that we've come up with. And it is a constant pressure to come up with the new, better thing. Focus on who you are, what the real value is that you bring to the marketplace, and use your products and your services as the tools where you deliver on whatever your promises are. So again, good to have great products and services. They are the tools that you deliver your value with. But the real value is you. You're it. Don't forget. Thank you for joining me today. Follow us on social media, and I'll see you next time.